today's story is a dinosaur story chosen for Max. This is called How to Grow a Dinosaur by Carol Hart and Ed Eaves. Hooray! Today's a brilliant sunshiny day. I can play in my paddling pool and ride my bike and build a den. I pull on my shorts, t-shirt and rush out into the garden then. I'll be... It's mum. She has a basket full of tools in one hand and some packets of seeds in the other. I know exactly what this means. Gardening. I hate gardening. But mum says, come on Alby, let's make a vegetable patch. All day long I weed and dig. It's so hot. Can't we finish now? I groan. Just as soon as we've planted these, says mum. She hands me some seeds. You might grow something really exciting. I rip open the packets and fling the seeds over the soil. Done. The next morning I open my window. What's going on? Outside is a jungle. This is crazy. I race out into the garden and... Whoa! I tumble into a hole. A very strange hole. It looks like a giant animal's footprint, but that's silly. The only creature that big would be... A dinosaur. Ah! It's a huge Tyrannosaurus Rex, and I think it's hungry. I dive into a tangle of creepers. The dinosaur thunders past and disappears. That was close. This place is scary. I want to go home and I'm hungry too. I spot some brightly coloured beans dangling from a branch. They smell amazing, but can I eat them? Then I notice a seed packet on the ground. Jelly bean tree, edible fruit, fast growing. Yippee, I knew it, they're jelly beans. Yum. This is mad. Jungles don't grow overnight. Jelly beans don't grow on trees. Dinosaurs are extinct. I wonder. I rummage in my pocket. Crikey, in my rush to plant these seeds, I didn't even look at the packets. Triassic jungle. Grow your own instant prehistoric landscape. Easy to grow. Tyrannosaurus rex. Feed well. Dinosaur mix. Scatter on the ground and take cover. Dinosaur mix? That means there are more of them. Suddenly, something grabs my t-shirt and drags me up, up into the air. Screech! It's a giant pterodactyl. Help! It drops me into a nest high up in the jelly bean tree. Three hungry chicks peck my feet. Don't eat me, I shout. Eat these! And I throw them a handful of jelly beans then... Grrrr! A terrifying roar fills the air. The T-Rex is right below me. He's having a fight with a Stegosaurus. It's a real live dino battle. I lean over to get a closer look. But the tree starts to sway and the T-Rex looks up. He glares straight at me, sniffs the air and licks his lips. Uh-oh, time to go. I jump out of the nest, but the T-Rex opens his terrible jaws and chomp. His teeth sink into the branch. I run for my life. Phew! There's my house. I dive into my room, slamming the window shut behind me. Made it. But now Mum's calling. I'll be. Let's water your seeds. Oh, no. I race downstairs to stop her going out, but it's too late. Oh, I'll be. She gasps. It's beautiful. Just scatter a few more seeds over here and it will be perfect. Alien atmosphere. Grow your own aliens and their galaxy overnight. Uh-oh.